This product for me in 2020 had the highest, how can I put this, expectation versus result ratio. Welcome to Price Plow. What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Ben, co-host of Price Plow, coming at you today with a video about a product that I heard a lot about. Um, I saw a lot of great reviews. Um, it's actually local to me. The owner, Jeff Long, is down South Jersey. I'm in Central Jersey. So I'm aware, uh, I was aware of his presence around here and I hear a lot of great things, but we didn't have any relationship with them. We still don't. Um, however, went out and bought the product and tried it out for myself and I wanted to review it and give you guys my thoughts on it. Uh, this is the product Pump and Focus from Like a Pro. Let's see if I can get that to focus in nicely. Eh, that's all right. Um, so just for transparency as we get this out of the way, uh, this product was sent for free. After I purchased the original one, Jeff sent me out some products just, I guess, to thank me. But um, I did go out and purchase some of my own. This is not a sponsored video. This is just my honest thoughts. And the product, a little bit of a breakdown and uh, anecdotal review on the effects. Um, before we get into the breakdown, I want to talk a little bit about the company. Uh, Jeff is extremely transparent about his uh, manufacturing, which is pretty cool for a company that does not manufacture themselves. Uh, he uses dynamic nutraceuticals down south for most of his products. Uh, if you can see the beta samples in a lot of his pictures on Instagram, which is really cool to see. He talks about the processes a lot, the testing, the, I mean, the fact that he actually has in the bottle what's on the label is pretty impressive. And when you use the product, it is extremely apparent because when you compare it to some of these huge dose products that may not be made as, at as uh, reputable places, you get a better result from this simple product than you do from those you know, huge panels. So not to say this stuff has low doses of anything. Um, all of these doses here are clinical, if not above clinical. Uh, there's probably a lower amount of ingredients than you're used to, but uh, I've come to love the simplicity and uh, really appreciate how it delivers. So the first ingredient in here is citrulline malate at one to one uh, ratio. It's six grams, which means you get three grams of citrulline, three grams of malic acid. Now, malic acid is definitely important for the raspberry flavor, but it also gives you some cellular energy. We all are familiar with citrulline. The pump that it gives three grams is obviously just like a simple clinical dose. We're not going crazy here with a high dose or anything. Very effective, starts off the pump very well. Booster pump, 65%, three grams here. I cannot believe that this stuff is this fine? Let's see if I can focus in on here. I'm just spilling all over my leg. But the stuff is so fine with three grams of ma of uh, glycerin, glycerin pump in here. It's impressive. It's pretty awesome, to be honest with you. I have found that if I can drink a gallon of water before I get into the gym and use this, I get a great pump from the water. Um, if I don't, I don't get as much from the glycerin pump, but that's kind of just the nature of the ingredient. Uh, I really enjoy the product for that reason. It helps me stay hydrated because I know that if I don't drink that water before I get to the gym, I'm not going to have as good of a pump. Betaine and Hydrus, three grams. Uh, we don't know if this is the trimethylglycine version, but we're a big fan of, of Betaine and Hydrus. Helps a lot with power output, helps a lot with hydration, um, and it can help with a, a pump because it'll pull water into the muscles. You got three grams here, which is definitely above the acceptable dose of two to two and a half grams. So happy to see that dosage in here. Um, definitely feel it in the product. Pico 2, very, very big fan of. Um, a lot of companies are opting for Pico 2 over the beta alanine for those performance benefits. You don't get that side effect of the paresthesia, the tingling of the skin. M a lot more comfortable that way. And uh, I think it has some really great benefits. We'll see more of it soon. Two grams here is a great dosage. Two grams of tyrosine. Now tyrosine is an awesome do uh, ingredient for uh, focus. We normally see it at a lower dosage though. Uh, I reached out to Jeff and I was like, dude, I love the focus from this product. I love that the tyrosine helps get me so focused in. But why is it so intense? And he's like, he told me that he opted for that higher tyrosine over a higher caffeine. And we'll see later the caffeine is not at a crazy dosage. It's, that's something that's very um, beneficial because of the, ty the higher tyrosine. I don't know if I would want more caffeine in this product, to be honest with you. I can see sulfate at a gram and a half. Normally see this at 750 milligrams to a gram, so happy to see that higher dosage for pumps. If you do take in carbohydrates pre workout, it's gonna help with metabolizing those and utilizing them well. Generally a big fan of agmatine. There's not a lot of human clinical studies. However, um, nice to see that it being used here in such a great dose. Next ingredient is Vaso 6. Now there has been some controversy around the studies and claims of Vaso 6, however, the anecdotal benefits are there, and you really can't argue with that all that much. Um, 300 milligrams here, some people will say that 600 milligrams is better, but 300 milligrams is the studied dose. 
like I said, we can't really use the claims from the studies anymore because of the issues that were brought up. But anecdotally, we know that it works. We know that it gives a good pump. And uh, I'm hoping to see more information on it soon. 250 milligrams of L-Norvaline. I have talked about this controversy around Norvaline before with uh, toxicity in the brain. Unfortunately, at the end of the day, it's kind of inconclusive. There's a uh, you know, 50-50 split on both sides of the toxicity. I'm a huge fan of Norvaline. It gives me a great pump. And with the amount of people using Norvaline, you'd think that if it really was that toxic or bad, we'd see more people having issues. I know that's a huge bro science thing to say, but it's my honest opinion on the, <laughs> on the ingredient. Um, I've used it in a, a few other products, uh, most notably Ghost Legend. I'm, I'm a big fan of it in there. Um, so 250 milligrams of it here, I think it's effective and it helps a lot with the um, actual benefit that we're trying to get out of here, which is the pump. Alpha GPC at 50%, you get 600 milligrams. Great dose is what we want to see here. Some people like higher dosages, but right here, Jeff's given us just what we need, yielding uh, 300 milligrams. It's going to feel good. It's going to be a nice little choline donor for your body. You know, a good amount of focus. Um, and you follow that up. I'm going to skip for one second down to the bottom. Hooperzine A at 200 micrograms is going to help with the acetylcholine that's formed in your brain to not be broken down as fast because it inhibits acetylcholine esterase. So you're helping out your uh, focus very well with this product, and I think that it's pretty evident when you use the product. It's it's not as tunnel visiony as like FSU from Inspired, but it definitely helps me stay focused in the gym. Last ingredient that I skipped over is 125 milligrams of caffeine. Um, I'm a big fan of how Jeff went low caffeine here, even though this is his simulant pre-workout. His non-simulant pre-workout would be outsized, which I've used and had a great pump on, but with the stimulants in here, he still went pretty low. Um, bodybuilders, a lot of bodybuilders look at caffeine as a vasoconstrictor. I don't necessarily agree with that in all cases, but I do believe that if you can get away, or if you can get by with less, it's probably a better idea for you. So overall, simple product, not a ton of ingredients, but dosed out well. There's not one ingredient here that I would say is underdosed. Super happy with the product. I have been using it at least twice a week, I would say. Um, I've actually even stacked it with their outsize, which I thought my arms were gonna fall off of my body when I did that. But overall, Jeff, you guys did an awesome job here. Um, love the products. I also am taking complete health right now. I'm gonna probably get some blood work at the end of the cycle of that just to show what it did to my body. Um, don't hold your breath on that. I'm not 100% not sure if I'm gonna be able to get that. But um, overall, the entire line has had positive effects for me. Um, I, I've been blown away by Burn Away, by this product, and I cannot wait to hopefully try out the Apple Cobbler when you come back out with it in your protein. Thanks so much for sending this out, Jeff. Um, if you have, I don't think we have them set up on our site. Um, I'll see if I can maybe get like their, I, we don't have a business relationship as I said before, but maybe we can get their products listed up there for you guys to be able to track sales. So uh, for all of your questions, there's not a blog for it right now, but you can put anything below, uh, comment, let me know what you have to say about it. If you've tried this out, let me know what your thoughts were. Thanks so much guys and have a great day. Welcome to Price Plow.